welcome back once again so today i'll be teaching us how to navigate around c panel and how to install a wordpress inside your c panel account so log in your c panel click on login as you be direct it will be redirected So here is our C panel. You can see there are available tons of features available in this C panel. So this is your file manager. This contains every file on your cms platform for example you may be using you may be using drupal with your c, with your c panel you may be using wordpress magento perigo joomla so all the files in your website this is where you can locate it you can see it right here so this is ftp accounts ftp connections maybe you want to import a file straight into your website these are the features you can use and we also have um jet backup so full account backup dns zone backup and other features like that so basically you can back up your website using all these features you can also back your you can also back up your email using all these features and these are your databases so php my admin my skill remote my sql databases my sql database assistant now these are your domains these are email suppose you want to create official email maybe you have seen some emails that will say something like info at your domain.com info at modeling.com or uh, something like that this is how this is where they create such email so you can create that such emails with these particular features let, let us take a look at it so you so you so you can you, you can see it here so just click on create so suppose I want to create AI script. I will set the password. I can also generate. I can also generate the password, and I create the email. So I can be using that email as an as as a normal Gmail or normal Yahoo mail, but it will be an official email. So that's how they do it. And these are metrics. Suppose you this is the full analytics of your website. So you so you can you, you can see those here. Now this is security. Security of your website. So we have um, IP blocker, SSL, CP guide, less encrypt, and more. So maybe maybe you have been you wanted to log into a website and they are telling you they are not accepting Nigeria. This is what they did. So, so they just block any IP that is coming from Nigeria or certain country. So that is for security purpose of the website. So over here we have software. So these are the software you can use to build a web app, websites, programming, and all that. So this is advanced. These are preferences. To change your password um to manage users to change site language um, something like multi languages and these are the web applications so, so suppose we want to install an app let us try to install a uh, wordpress app so let so let's create a, a subdomain for that so come here and click on subdomains so let's call it test 
So click on create. So the subdomain has been created. Now click this. Now let's try to um, to install WordPress. So you can see right here. This should be in English. So you can see all the available app we can we, we can install on this particular control panel so let us locate wordpress and here it is click on it so you can see now click on install this application so you can see it is loading and um, here we have so choose the domain so we created this subdomain so we'll be using test dot that's that is subdomain we created and um, let us choose this to be English so it will auto generate password for you so let us, let us copy this password So, copy the username. And um, come here. Then click on install. Okay, the web page seems to be loading. Oh. Okay, so it is it is processing and here we have our new WordPress log. But you still have to wait. Now the, the installation is completed. So now we can now visit that particular website and you can log in as well. So you can see and you can log in using the details given to you. So suppose you want to log out, let's try to log out. And now you want to log in. Remember these are the details you will be using. So you can click on remember me. And you can see here we are again so that's it for today guys if you have any question let me know in the comment section down below thank you very much